Hello everyone, welcome back to our math class, preparing for SE, uh, class 10 student. <clears throat> we are doing set 19 today uh, from group C. Uh, in last class we have discussed group A and group B. I have told you to complete up to group B all. Now from group C, question number 11, chapter set. In a survey of a group, 50% like to listen radio, 60% like to watch television, 30% of them neither listen radio nor watch television. Then we have to represent the above information in Venn diagram. And we have to find percentage of people who like to listen radio as well as watch television. <clears throat> Let R and T represent the group of people who like to listen radio and watch television respectively question is given in person that's why number of you is 100 percent number of r 50 percent like to watch uh, listen radio 60 percent like to watch television 30 percent of them neither neither means Complement if their negative word is there. Complement 30%. Now let's do the second first. Find the percent of people who like to listen radio as well as television. R U N E N T. Let's find number of U minus number of R U N E N T. Ko complement 100 minus 30. 40% now intersection number of R intersection T we have to calculate R intersection T that is number of R plus number of T minus number of R union T 50 plus 60 minus sorry it is 70 Uh, 110 minus 70 is 40 percent therefore 40 percent of them like to listen radio as well as watch television 40 percent of them like to do both kind of activities now first Venn diagram we have to represent in Venn diagram better to use compass and make neat and clean radio television intersection is 40 percent r is given 50 so 50 minus 40 is only 10 percent if only was given then we could write all but here it is given r this total is 50 similarly t is 60 here 40 so 20 percent 40 plus 20 is 60 70 80 90 100 30 percent complement outside we have to try it okay we have to understand the question terminology given in question what are given and what should be calculated for that by using venn diagram also we can do or by using formula also we can do 
our next question question number 12 is from arithmetic it is given from uh, money exchange in nepal the cost of television is rupees 1 lakh 40 thousand which i cannot afford in england the same television costs 900 pound and in usa 1240 dollar now in which country is the television cheaper cheapest the cheapest or cheaper whatever we are not learning grammar here cost of television in Nepal what is the cost of television in Nepal 1 lakh 40 thousand this is the cost of television in Nepal now let's find in other countries also and then compare in which uh, it is the least that is cheaper than other countries let's find cost of television in England it is given 900 pound and it is also given one pound is 131 so when we convert this pound into Nepali currency what shall be done we can simply multiply if we convert into foreign currency then we have to divide if we convert into Nepali currency then we have to multiply rupees 131 into 900 so we get here 131 into 9 is 1179 11 79 zero zero it means one lakh seventeen thousand nine hundred it means it is cheaper than in Nepal let's find in US also cost of television in USA not in America USA <laughs> it is given twelve hundred forty dollar in USA twelve hundred forty dollar let's convert into Nepali currency for that also we have to multiply according to question one dollar equals to 107 that is why multiply by 107 107 into Barasit Salis is one lakh thirty two thousand six hundred eighty now same television cost one lakh forty thousand in Nepal in England one lakh seventeen thousand nine hundred in US one lakh thirty two thousand six eighty now which is the cheapest one this is here yeah. comparing the cost uh, in which country is the television cheapest uh, in England the cost of television is cheaper and most expensive is in Nepal one like forty thousand but it is given in which country it is cheaper in England it is cheaper than other countries according to the question okay next question question number 13 is for mensuration it is given here a square base pyramid question is like this in the given figure the length of side of a square base pyramid is 20 centimeter and the length of sloping edge means this is not slant height. Eh? Slant height one echo your height of the triangle, your beach quite deco by your slant height unto you. And a vertical height one echo beach ma perpendicular line deco by height unto you. But it is given here sloping edge of triangle, your triangle ko line deco by error. It is edge, neither slant height nor vertical height. Now from here we have to calculate slant height and height then only we can calculate the volume of pyramid okay let's solve it here length of base is given how much 20 centimeter and then is is given 26 centimeter 
Now, how can we calculate slant height? Slant height. How can we calculate slant height? Look here. One right angle triangle is formed. Here, 90 degree h square is hypotenuse now let's find perpendicular where base is 20 by 2 that is 10 centimeter how can we find actually perpendicular is equals to h square minus b square but your h is e square minus b is half of a square root 26 co square minus 10 co Square that centimeter square you square so centimeter is square so centimeter centimeter square above 26 co squares 676 hundred and your hundred square now 676 minus 100 is 576 which is 24 centimeter which square root is 24 means slant height is 24 now what is the formula to calculate volume our volume calculate gonna like it h is required because 1 by 3 a square h is the formula so again find vertical height l square minus a by 2 co square a fair yeah vertical height you yeah, but right angle triangle form means so, yeah, 90 degrees so, yo minus yo sign so. so slant height we got 24 centimeter square yeah, a by 2 one echo 10 by 2 un, so, so uh, 10 centimeter ko square our 24 ko square one echo 576 minus 10 ko square one echo 100 476 centimeter square our root under 476 पने को 21.82 centimeter now let's find volume of pyramid what is the formula 1 by 3 a square h 1 by 3 a is 20 square into 21.82 centimeter into 20 co square divided by 3 2908.99 centimeter cube we can leave this otherwise 2909 centimeter cube also can be written as volume okay next question question number 14 from algebra now here let's copy question b by 1 minus 2b b by 1 plus 2b your 2b 1 plus 4b square 16b cube 16b 4 minus 1 now let's solve from these two only. Uh, Your one minus two b ra one plus two b LCM b sanga one plus two b yo b sanga one minus two b. Let's copy this to same. Sixteen b cube sixteen b four minus one. Now let's multiply b one za b. 2b square b1 the b minus 2b square now here a minus b a plus b a square minus b square these all we can copy as it is just a kota se sardine pasadi kolai now this 2b square to be cancel yo bane ko 2b by 1 minus 4b square you have one equal to b 1 plus 4 b square this you can copy as it is now again we take lcm from this two first and second expression 4 b square 1 plus 4 b 
square now your 2b lie which one is not there with that we have to multiply 1 plus 4b square is not there so 1 plus 4b square le multiply garne so here also 1 minus 4b is not here so 1 minus 4b square le multiply garne but this is not cross multiplication eh? some students think that we have to do cross multiply if these are not same then it is okay but if denominators are same then no need to multiply 2b 1s are 2b 8b cube 2b 1s are 2b 8b cube divided by a square minus b square 4 ko square when equals 16 b4 16 b cube 16 b4 minus 1 oh here it is minus a eh? plus minus minus these two will be cancelled 4b 1 minus 16 b4 your 16 b4 is eh, sorry b3 Yapani 1 minus 16 b4 can be written for that we can sub uh, change this sign hey, 16 b4 minus 1 is there 1 minus 16 b4 writing now both are same that is why 1 minus 16 b4 yeah 4b minus 16 b cube now from here uh, let's take 4b common then 1 minus 4b square of your one echo a plus 4b square a minus 4b square a plus b into a minus b these two will be cancelled 4b by 1 plus 4b square okay First, these two taking common ALCM and then from again and from first and last again. Okay, class, today's last question from question number 15. It is also from algebra equations. Uh, question number 15. If ramp gives one of the marble from what he possesses to sita ram sang bhae ko kei marble bata usle sita lai din cha then it will be equal they will have equal number of marbles and if sita gives one then ram will have double of the marble with what sita is left with yadi ram lai chai sita le dio bhanne ram sang double huncha now we have to find what is the number find the number of marbles possessed by each other each initially sorry unni haru sanga shuru ma kati wada marble thyo tyo pata lagaune so let ram and sita had x and y number of marble respectively in case one if ram gives if ram gives to sita they are not equal but when ram gives one sita will receive one hey when ram gives one sita will receive one that is why they are equal are right? Yeah, the, yeah, what is given from what he possesses to Sita, then they will have equal number of marble. The Ramli Uda Dinsa, Sita Leuda Pounsa, then they will have equal number. So from your x is equals to y plus 1 plus 1. This minus goes here. x is equals to y plus 2 equation 1. Our fairy case 2 massa when Sita gives y gives 1 not equal when sita gives one of the marble to ram then ram will have double ram sanga chi double cha abo yo chai ram ko yaha double hunu ko matlab where do we have to multiply 
in sitas we have to multiply because you double on the that two loss of this lazy multiply got one other other you two loans are equal on its answer to make equal we have to multiply to sitas case 2y minus 2 is equals to x plus 1 2y minus 2 minus 1 equals to x x one equal 2y minus 3 equation 2 over this is also x this is also x from equation 1 and 2 let's solve this this is also x this is also x that is why y plus 2 is equals to 2y minus 3 y minus 2y is equals to minus 3 of your minus 2 out alada minus 2 y minus 2 minus y is equals to minus minus 5 minus minus plus this will be cancel y is equals to 5 means sita add 5 again from 1 x is equals to y plus 2 that is 5 plus 2 7 therefore initially ram had seven marbles and sita had five marbles ram sanga path seven ani sita sanga path look here right foundation ma ram le euta dio sita sla euta padyo equal cha bhaneko cha aba sita le euta dio ram ma euta padyo tara ram sanga double cha tei bhera sita ma multiply garne dui ta equation solve garne you will get the numbers okay thank you this much for today see you in next class stay safe stay healthy bye bye